Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to discuss the example for absolute value. So solve the situation 1 over modulus of x minus 3 greater than 3 over modulus x plus 1. My suggestion would be cross multiply because given the denominator where we have the absolute value, so meaning that it is always positive. So we are allowed to cross multiply. So the modulus of x plus 1 is greater than 3 multiplied with the modulus of x minus 3. Then do remember to state the restriction where the x cannot be equal to 3 and at the same time the x cannot be equal to negative 1. Next, what we have to do is to square both sides. So if we square both sides, we will have square root of bracket x plus 1 square bracket square greater than 9 square root of x minus 3 bracket square so kindly simplify the situation where we will have x plus 1 to the power of 2 greater than 9 multiply with x minus 3 to the power of 2 kindly expand the situation so x squared plus 2x plus 1 greater than 9 multiplied with x squared minus 6x plus 9. So rewrite the situation. x squared plus 2x plus 1 greater than 9x squared minus 54x plus 81. So kindly rearrange the situation. So 9x squared minus x squared minus 54x minus 2x plus 81 minus 1 less than 0. Simplify the situation. 8x square minus 56x plus 80 less than 0. So kindly factor the 8. So we have x square minus 7x plus 10 less than 0. So kindly factorize the x squared minus 7x plus 10 and we will have x minus 5 multiplied with x minus 2 less than 0. Since this is a simplest form, so it is the time to determine the sign where we have a negative sign. Next, what we have to do is to split the situation and then do remember always assume positive. So where we will have x greater than 5 x greater than 2. So do remember the restriction x cannot be equal to 3, x cannot be equal to negative 1. Kindly illustrate the situation in the number line. So locate the value where we have 2 then 5. So as a reminder, the value of negative 1 is located over here and the value of 3 is located over here. So kindly illustrate the situation in a number line. So where we have empty circle for 2 and then towards the right. Same goes to the 5, empty circles towards the right. So kindly fill up the space with a negative sign because this is a positive real number line. Then what we have to do is to multiply the situation where we have negative, negative, then we will have a positive followed by a negative, then we have positive, positive, then positive. Kindly refers to the sign. We need a negative, we want a negative region. So here will be the answer. So finally, the answer would be value of x such that where we have x is greater than 2 and less than 3. Or x is greater than 3 and less than 5. That will be the solution set. So if it's an interval form, my answer would be 2 until 3 where 2 and 3 is not included, union. 3 until 5 where the 3 and 5 is not included. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you think the video is useful, kindly consider to like comment, share and subscribe.